So things are starting to feel a little bit different here in the real estate market in Sonoma County. In August, sales were down 44% compared with August of 2021, and inventory is up 145% since January. Is the real estate market here in Sonoma County crashing? That's exactly what we're gonna look into. We will identify where the Sonoma County real estate market is headed, and help you identify if you should buy, sell, or more importantly, how hard you should smash that like button. So if you've been paying any attention at all to the real estate market here in Sonoma County, you're starting to see some changes. First of all, homes are sitting on market for a lot longer than they have been. And those homes that would have previously gone in a contract within just a week are now seeing price reductions. And generally speaking, it seems like half of the buyers that were actively looking have simply vanished, they've disappeared. Adios. The main reason that you've been seeing this is due to inflation. As you have been seeing in the news, the Fed has been aggressively fighting inflation by increasing the federal fund rate to try to pull money back out of the economy. Conversely, mortgage rates have nearly doubled. In January, they're at approximately 2.7%, and in August, they were at 5.875%. To put that into context, if you were looking at a $750,000 home in January, your mortgage payment would be approximately $3,100. However, at today's rate, that same house would cost you $4,500 per month. So why exactly are home prices not coming down significantly here in Sonoma County? While the headlines would make most people assume that home prices are gonna come crashing down, when you take a closer look at the data, it explains why they haven't. However, if you had two homes and you said that inventory increased by 100%, you would still only have a total of four homes. And despite the initial headline of 146% increase in inventory, we are still at historically low levels of housing here in Sonoma County, actually below 2021 levels, which is a very busy year for real estate. In the beginning of this year, we actually saw inventory levels drop below 300 total homes for the entire county. What that brought was absolute record high prices, higher than we've ever seen here in Sonoma County. In the spring market, inventory started to increase, but it also brought inflation. And as inflation continued to increase, mortgage rates also increased and as a result, push buyers out of the marketplace. We are currently seeing that inventory levels are lower than they were in 2021, and as a result, home prices are correcting, but they're not crashing. So the Fed will be meeting at the end of September, and if inflation continues to persist, the Fed will increase the federal fund rate, and lending institutions will increase mortgage rates. So what exactly will real estate look like over the next 12 months here in Sonoma County? There are two leading indicators we wanna watch out for. Those are inflation and inventory levels. One of the ways we can determine if inflation is going up or down is through a tool called the Consumer Price Index, also known as CPI. And it's believed that over the last couple months, interest rates may have actually climaxed. If inflation continues to cool, mortgage rates could come down as early as the end of this year or the beginning of next year. However, don't expect that interest rates are going to come back down to the record levels that they were just recently. Zillow, CoreLogic, Fannie Mae, Freddie Mac, and Goldman Sachs all predict single digit gains in home values in 2023, with the exceptions of some overvalued areas such as Boise, Idaho, or Austin, Texas. So if you're thinking about buying or selling in Sonoma County, what should you do with this information? Well, if you're a seller, you should go to market before October and before the seasonality changes and there are even less buyers in the marketplace. If you do have some flexibility on timing, you could wait and see what happens with with interest rates and if interest rates do come down in the spring or summer months go to market then however don't expect that you're gonna get significantly more than you would today and if you're a buyer in the marketplace the best deals could be between now and the springtime or when interest rates start to come back down again because that is when buyers are gonna start coming back to the market and bringing stability to home prices. You wanna purchase when everyone else is in, and right now is that time. However, don't expect to get 50% off your next purchase because record low inventory levels are gonna prevent home prices from crashing down. If you have any questions, please comment below. Otherwise, make sure to like and subscribe so that way you can stay current on what is happening here in the real estate market in Sonoma County.